Hot. Rosalie has grown up so fast, it's time for her to leave the nest. Should we send her off to travel around, or let her move into her own apartment? My thoughts exactly. You're watching me news. Daredevil Battler took part in the latest Island Challenge event. The challenge? To eat an extra, extra, extra large baked potato in just 60 minutes. Battler bravely shrugged off the concerns of the audience, and took up the challenge. Battler started off well. But he gave up when he had only one bite left to eat. So unfortunately the challenge ended in failure. Competitive eating is highly dangerous, so please don't try this at home. We asked some islanders for their thoughts on the matter. Really? If you think that's cool, you should hear my story. Thanks for watching. For your 10 o'clock me news, this is Viridian Smallin, signing off. Hey. I wish I could be a kid again. Please turn me into a kid again. This should be fun. I'm a kid again. I can't believe it. This is gonna be so fun. Thanks. I feel so young and carefree. Here, I want you to have this. Listening to my new CD puts me in such a good mood. I'm a Jedi. Will you play with Adam for a while? Thank you. Isn't that nice, Adam? If you keep doing that so fast, you'll make him dizzy. You're watching me news. Shinatori Island police arrested Dr. Dave today. He is suspected of randomly adding hot mustard to innocent foods. According to the police report, Dr. Dave was caught yellow-handed. He added mustard to a candy apple that Theridian was making. When questioned, Dr. Dave could only mutter, I don't know why I did it. We asked some islanders for their thoughts on the matter. I'm lost. Do you know where we are? I'm a big fan of Minus. 
Thanks for watching. For your 8 o'clock me news, this is Nigel Thornberry, signing off. I'm gonna cook up something tasty. I use only the freshest veggies in my cooking. I'm really getting tangy with this dish. Bon appetit! Ah, the joy of cooking. Get over it. I got a strange letter. Someone wants to meet me up on the roof. I don't know who wrote it. Should I go? It's so mysterious, isn't it? I'm gonna go see what this is all about. Something looks different about you. Who on earth was that? Oh well, I'm still glad I went. Oh no, I can't find the book I borrowed from Dennis. Hey, you want to hear my impression of Chris? More cowbell. What do you think? I knew it. I should do this for a living. My dad snores like a freight train. It's so obnoxious. Have you ever had that dream of reaching for his life? Of finding they are all gone out. What of all this blood? Can't leave this body here too easy to be found. But I need that slide. This is such a nightmare. To go get a slide or forget my trophy. with camera in my face, accuse me of not caring at all at first. Yet you are the one, spreading these lies, and disingenuous, assertion all lies, so your mouth I now got to silence those lies. You don't earth me cold, and reason to fight and kill the reapers. Has it that Shaz recently bought a pirate ship? 
Well, really, that's epic. I wonder if I could get a ride on it. My hair has been a disaster recently. Want to borrow my pear shampoo? It will make your hair silky. I feel pretty sluggish these days. Go home and get some rest. I like slugs. I've been thinking about changing my hairstyle. I'm picturing zebra stripes. Don't do it. That would be very unique. Do you ever feel like we always end up talking about the same things over and over? Totally. <laughs> My voice is naturally loud. It makes it hard to keep secrets. Haha. <laughs> oh. I how girls look alike. What's new? I got a strange letter. Someone wants to meet me up on the roof. I don't know who wrote it. Should I go? It's so mysterious, isn't it? I'm gonna go see what this is all about. Did you know that in the basement? Actually, I'd better not say. Who on earth was that? It was pretty creepy, but I'm still glad I went. It's time for some quirky questions. Whose favorite hobby is picking noses? Me. Now for the next question.
Who wants a life full of vampire piggies? Um. And finally, your last question. manners Me. thanks for playing see you next time I'm gonna cook up something tasty this won't take long one bite of this and you're never gonna want to eat anything else starting to feel better. Here, I want you to have this. I wonder if I could be a skosh more open-minded. No, bet not. It's way too hot out today. I got a strange letter. Someone wants to meet me up on the roof. I don't know who wrote it. Should I go? It's so mysterious, isn't it? I'm gonna go see what this is all about. If reading in the car makes you nauseous, sell your car and buy a boat. Who on earth was that? Oh well, I must have gained something from such a strange experience. always looks so dashing, don't you think? I always notice that. So dreamy. He's so refined. I'm not so sure. A bug flew into my apartment this morning. I'm still freaked out about it. That's the worst. Is it still there? Ew, ew, ew. But talk is not allowed. Seriously, I just ate. So I've been thinking, actually never mind. This is something I can't tell anyone. I have to know. I'll die of curiosity. What? Come on. What if you whisper it? It's time for some quirky questions. devoted to peanut butter. Me. Now for the next question. Who would rather be the president? Finally, your last question. Who 
wants a life full of sharks? Um. Thanks for playing. See you next time. I don't know. I have feelings for Winston. I've got to tell her. How should I tell her? Where should I tell her? Should I get changed first? Okay, I'm ready. Time to gather my courage and tell her how I feel. She didn't even show up. I was rejected. Ouch. <laughs> 